Hey guys, Masan here, just here to introduce another cool deck, this time what I think is the best deck in Horror right now. So this deck is Aggro Shaman, as everyone kind of knows about. There are two variations, or three, multiple variations, in fact, a matter of fact. Um, but the one that involves with the one Doomhammer, one Bloodlust, I have a particular version made on myself with the... Only one Azure Drake, a lot of people think the Azure Drake is one of the best Shaman cards, which I tend to agree, however, I do not think you need as much a draw or even spell power because this deck has really no spell damage, <laughs> except for the Lightning Storm, which can be useful with the Azure Drake, but you don't really need Azure Drake as a draw card in my opinion, because you can always use something else. Basically, this deck relies on heavy 1 and 2 and 3 drop to remove and kill the opponent. It, it often actually overpowers and out tempos a zoo, a face hunter, as well as many other tempo decks out there. I do think this deck is, will does perform the best in the current meta existing. However, the meta may change. The the deck might actually the meta you know the the the, the meta is depends on where you actually are, and I do believe the some cards need to be swapped out in and out depends on where you are. If you are feeling in if you're going against a heavy swarmy meta most likely compared to instead of a heavy control meta uh you should consider having two lightning storms which is what i'm running right now or running two master of evolution if you're feeling a little bit midi mid-range because you will be getting huge benefit from trading with your opponent's minion with your minions and then go face afterward when you have enough damage built up on board or against heavy control decks, then you might want to consider Zerdrick as extra draw cards. So However, me personally, I think the uh, instead of Zerdrick, I like the well, why not just have other heavy cards again in control mana? Is how I feel like the Alkir, perhaps a Fire Mental, or even Mist Color, uh, or possibly everything is awesome. Uh, or second plus plus. I don't know, or second Doom Hammer if you want to just go face against control decks because you might might want to be able to out tamp your opponent by just going for face if you're there playing control deck. And let's play a few games and let's see how it goes. Roll versus Gina. All right, going against a tempo mage lately. I've been seeing a lot of tempo mage over the control mages out there. Um, I me and myself played the freeze and freeze mage with the Yog Saron, but. It was not the best thing ever, I'm gonna be honest. It was most, one of the most fun thing ever, though. There's just not enough spells in the thing, I feel. To be more effective. Although I think the deck is not bad. It has performed me alright. Um, right now, I kept my 4-drop because I can go with the 1, 2, and then coin out 4-drop, which is a perfect tempo-wise. It's a little unfortunate that he start with the Mana Worm turn 1. And then I... Mulligan away my flanked totem because it'll be the best thing ever to give it. Uh. Anyways, playing the. In case I I could I could have gone with the coming out juggler, but then he could just go for frost and frostbolt on my juggler, and then it'll be terrible. So let's play it safe. All right, arcane blast and the hero power that could have been done exactly the same way. With a frost uh, I don't know this uh, he couldn't actually do it on turn two, so maybe I should be just one for a flank. Ooh, Tusker to Temig is uh hang on. I could coin out four drop. Faceless. Alright. It's a little bit of risky play for me, or is it actually? Because it might actually have a two drop and frostbolt. Then it can, you know, use a man. I don't even really have any AoEs or two. The, the, the reason I made this play is because I can still go for a Plankton Totem, uh, Totem Golem next turn. And I don't really have any other particular interesting card to play on this turn. Anyways, so, exact same play in my opinion. I don't like the card, man. Temple Mages are still in. Because of that. Play because the card. Left. Oh my god, double arcane missile. Is this the. Finish him! Yog Sarun deck? Oh my god, no! What? Oh, come on. That's just not cool. That's just not cool. Holy crap, the temple. Oh, the temple mages are strong. 
Uh, I will go to my strongest play, obviously. I'm spending six mana for this card, by the way. If I'm not being obvious. Ping? Sure. Wait, why would you ping, actually? This doesn't make too much sense. And going face. Wow, this guy is looking for blood. Ooh, being flumped a blow actually could save me. Hopefully. Did you bring some fish? Hopefully. Oh, shoot. Wait, is that... Hang on. Okay, okay. That may, That's actually not necessarily a mistake. Mm, because it, it will save my faceless. Right? It's like I could have saved my... Totem Golem, but yeah, I think this is okay, actually. Alright, I'm at 4 health right now, which is uh, really, really, really scary. So let's put up... Uh, let's board clear with the flanking Totem. Kill the Water Vintel. Oh my god, 4 health already, it's a turn 7. More him, you know? Oh boy. Alright, so... He's definitely, definitely gonna help. I can go with the mana type to him and flank him and think from blow, actually. And hopefully... Hopefully... Mana Tide Totem is gonna help me get some next couple of turns lethal. If he draws into Frostbolt, I'm dead. If he draws into Vimal, I'm dead. If he draws into anything but the Cabal system, I am dead. So, oh boy. It all depends on what he drew with the Cabal system. If he has the Frostbolt, he cannot actually play it yet. He can't, well, he can play it, but then, you know, uh, he still has to ping it next turn. So he does not have lethal yet. Oh, a secret. Wonder what it is. Alright, Trog on the left. I can go with the Hero Power and Doomhammer. I already have a Trog. Well, I have a Taunt, so I don't need to worry about these Trog cards yet. So no Trog card should be able to kill me. Unless he has a Fireball and Charge, then he should be killing me anyways, so it doesn't really matter. But the next turn! How much damage do you have here? Oh boy, we have a 5. Plus 18. <laughs> that already is lethal. Can I out tempo my tempo major opponent? The answer is. Someday I'll be just like is... you. Is it playing with me? Is that ice block? Alright, let's just go face out of this. Whew. I was able to out temper my temper major phone. Alright, that is the game. Whew. Hey guys, Masan here. Thanks for watching. Please join my channel by clicking this subscribe button and check out more of my videos right here. I appreciate your support. You're awesome. Stay beautiful, Masan out.